All right, we are here for our first broadcast of SimCity. Got my new intro. Um, and usually the sound is supposed to be playing for the intro in the background, but it doesn't seem to be playing. So I'm doing this test record just to see if things are going to work. Now, I've been working on a city for a while called Sheldon. And I thought I'd go back to it. It's been a while since I've actually gone there. And this is on the West Coast Server 1. Ooh, unlabeled. Oh, you gotta love this. Okay, so let's see what else we can play. Unable to load the region, the city data at this time. Please try again. So it looks like we are unable to connect to this region. So we're going to go ahead and quit out real quick and see if we can get back in to a different region. And give this a second. There we go. We're going to try it. We're in the West one. I'm going to switch over to West. Uh, West 2 is actually, I think, my first city that I've ever created is in here. And I don't remember much about it, but I remember that I had a good time playing. We're going to check it out, see if we can get connected to this one. Hello, EA. And I love this game. SimCity is um, a pretty awesome game. Uh, once you get into it, it becomes an addictive mess, and you want to find all the time you can to be able to play it. Trying to really limit the amount of time that I'm playing with each one of the games, because as we go through the in-game series, I want to be able to do things like SimCity, I want to do Skyrim, I want to do Dead Space 3, I want to do Tomb Raider. Um, and whatever other games that you know happen to, to pop up, uh, there's this uh, Diablo 3 I might go back to eventually. And uh, another game that's like Diablo 3 or the Diablo series called Torchlight. And the newest one is Torchlight 2. It's been out for a, a pretty good amount of time, but it's a really good alternative to the Diablo series. So as you can see here, I've got my city, and I've got my oil wells. Uh, oh, looks like I am losing some money each hour. What do we got over here? Is this my, okay, that's my headquarters. And we found over time that the headquarters doesn't even have to stay open. It, we don't even have to waste money on it. But it's still, you know produces what we need uh, or does what we need it, it gives us the abilities to do certain things so we've got two oil wells areas that are working just fine how are we doing on our electricity our electricity oh man we're good to go we've, we've been pie looks like we're uh, getting it from the region we also have a oil power station here might be able to go without, or am I selling it to the region? You know, I might actually be selling it. Yes, I'm actually selling it to the region. Good for me. Cool. See, I haven't been in this in this game for a while, so okay, let's take a look at our water. Our water is awesome. We are producing a crap load of water through our water pump. Let's see how the map looks. We want to make sure that we're not going to... Oh my god. Okay, that is a lot of water. That is an incredible amount of water. Holy crap. I don't know how that has been happening. Maybe my sewage? Because a lot of times you can get the sewage... Oh, oh, I'm selling sewage off to other people. Yes, I am. I am selling sewage off to other people. But, uh, let's see. I wonder how much I'm paying for that. Oh, right here. So my sewage. I buy... Oh. Stop buying water. 
stop buying electricity. Don't need that stuff. It's going to save us some money. The sewage problem. Oily Bay has a sewage problem. Look at it. I love the map and the way it looks like it, you know, it's all brown, selling the poop to someone else. Send it off to them. Uh, let's see. Using 34 for $35. Okay. So that's nothing. $35 an hour? Psst. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, so let's take a look at our water now that we're not... Yeah. Okay, it looks like we are good as far as resources now. Take a look at our government. Uh, we are doing fine. We've got our city hall. We've got the mayor's house. Haven't been approved for a mansion yet. Let's take a look at the... Yeah, we've only got 20,000 people are protesting too much crime. Well, I've got enough money. Crime, uh-oh. Eight crimes per day. But look at the coverage we've got. Let's see, okay, let's take a look at the crime map. Holy crap. Crime is really high. Oh, that's the police precinct. Let me guess, this is a casino over here. What is this guy? Is a vacant residence. It looks like they are taking up shop on there. And what else we got? Oh, well, looks like I mean we're doing all right. Doing all right. Do we have, are we educated here? We are not educated. That is probably the reason why we have so much crime is because there's no education system. Nope, no schools at all. Okay, we'll work on that in a bit. Kind of limited on time today on what I can accomplish and do. I think I'm okay with that. Let's take a look at, are we sick? Are we healthy? We've got six sims. We have one death per day. That's nothing. We've got uh, no fire coverage. Uh, let's take a look at our town. And see where we can maybe put something. I've got things really close to the front entrance. I'm not. I'm kind of worried about how traffic is going to end up. And since this is my first town, I didn't build very many avenues. It looks like I've got an avenue here, going over here, coming around, and coming around here. But uh, do I have any other things like? No oil. Okay, no, I got oil here. That's doing just fine. Yeah, it looks like they're all working now. Oh, I'm back to profit. And the trade depots were full. We're sending out things via rail. Are we sending out things via rail? Yeah, right here. Trade port. So that's probably why we're making so much money, is we just got things going out. Technology, nope. Anything like some enjoyment? Might come back with some gambling. Oh, no, we got gambling. Doing all right there. Doing all right there. So they're making us some money. So that's not 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 terribly. It's productive. Okay, now let's take a look at RC. Let's go ahead and I I've been doing this lately which is planting trees and it just makes my city look better um, suppose oop, oop, well I guess I just placed down a natural park there that was an accident I shouldn't have had I'm gonna speed this thing up the trees grow faster as you the faster that you set the city now it looks like I've got some areas that I started mapping out but I didn't actually do anything with what is going on here planting trees but nothing's growing okay dun, 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 dun. grow trees grow trees grow you make my city look so pretty now I did go through and the first time I started playing I thought oh you know what 
I just need to put down parks. Parks make people happy, you know, they increase the land value, and they uh, just make things better all in general. But then I found out that based on the type of park that you put down, it's key towards the uh, the wealth of the people that you put in that area, that you want in that area. So right now, I have a lot of basic stuff. So this is a single, this is the most uh, low rent type of places that you can put in an area. And even though I've got a, I got a kind of a medium wealth thing going on here, this is definitely a low, low wealth area. So this over here, the plazas and the formal areas, this is going to be used to raise these areas from the low health or low wealth, I should say, to the higher wealth areas so that, you know, uh, we can get higher wealth businesses within this area. What I'm going to do is, since these guys can't grow, now as you can see, I automatically increase them to a good low wealth area. And I'm going to fit another one over on this side. Oh, goodness, that's not going to be good. Um, I might have to stick it down. Let me check the formal ones. Sometimes, for whatever reason, they'll allow certain ones. Oh, you know what? My road is so close to the edge of this. It's not letting it... Not letting me put it in there. Uh, I might have to go with a more natural because I want to see if I can fit it right in here. Well, you know what? Let me get rid of these guys. These pawns. And what is this? This is a wavy path park. Get rid of that because I really want to increase the value in this area by putting down something spectacular. So here we go. Oh, this is gonna work. Okay, so this is this one's better. It still wants to put it tall. I want to put it against the street. I don't want to put it across the street. I want to put it. Oh, I okay. I want to put it lengthways right next to the street. None of these let me do that. So I might have to sacrifice an edge, which is fine. I can probably find something that will just take oh, there we go. See, now we're getting better. And then right here, look at this. Oh, that's a shuttle bus station. Let's see if I can put something next to the shuttle bus station. Something I just don't like that. It just doesn't allow me Oh look at this. I can put it in the corner. I can put that in the corner. Okay, so now we're st starting to see some of the grayish area like this right here. So we're doing a little bit better. Uh, these guys are doing fine. This red is not good. So I'm going to get rid of this pond. And I'm going to put in a high wealth. I'm going to put in a bigger one. Yeah, this is good. I want something really nice. There we go. So now we've increased that area. We kind of reduced that. Um, still over here, people are just not happy. So let me see. And I never tried this before. If I can see if I can actually plop down some along the side. Where okay, this might work. There we go. So we've balance this out over here something right here the short tree oh that probably came from this yeah that's, so that's a medium um, I still want to increase this area what is here I don't think there's anything really there that I want so I'm gonna go ahead and kill this guy I'm going to go to formal and grab a small piece area because I want to. I want it on this street over here. 
Look at that. That is just terrible. Terrible, terrible. But at least I kind of balanced it out a little bit. These are still low wealth er or medium wealth areas, which is not bad. But I really want to increase these to high wealth. I want to see these increase. So I'm going to blow out some of these medium parks and go with something a little fancier. Nice, thank you. And put something here. There we go. See, now we're starting to see the high wealth appear. And we've got this guy. This guy is a medium. We're going to replace him with a high wealth. And... Uh -huh. See? I haven't had this problem before, but suddenly, today, I'm having this problem. And it's now saying that I need to roll back. And the rollback should fix whatever it is. Now, I have no... I, I mean, I haven't played in this area for a while. So, I have no idea what effect this is going to have against my city. <sighs> okay, I have another one. <laughs> this is just the way it goes sometimes. I've heard that many people have had issues and you know I've heard lots of complaints and everything oh I'm hitting my limit I'm gonna actually have to we're gonna take a real quick look at Coal Gamble which is a coal based city that I started adding to some gambling ideas so we're gonna take a quick look at this and see how we're doing here and then I've got to run and look at this. This is beautiful. Time to relocation. All right. This place is looking very nice. Coming along. Look at that. I've got lots of things. This area was pretty nice. Comes with a rail. Comes with a nice entrance over here. I've got my large fire station. Got some decent buildings going on. I've got, uh, let's see what I've got here. Got my industrial area. It's getting a little bit polluted over here in a coal mine, but I'm not worried about that. It's not as bad as the city that I had the nuclear explosion in. That was really fun. I've got my water pumping station, which is doing wonderful. Oh, look at that. Okay, I do have a nuclear plant over here. These are, I warn anybody who is going to use a nuclear plant, keep a very close eye on it. These things will occasionally explode if you do not have enough water resources going to, um, to it. Now, right now, oh, see, now it's considered unsafe. So, that's not good. That's very not good. So, I'm going to actually... Turn it off and turn it back on. This seems to reset it sometimes, but oh crap, it's still considered unsafe. I gotta look at this. Oh my god, this is not good. Okay, uh, I need to put in a wind station. Oh, this is perfect. This is a good area, and I'm gonna add uh, quickly, quickly add. I'm gonna speed up time so I can actually edit this and, and get this going. Um, we need some major win. We need to be able to I'm going to expand this and just start putting down these things. I, I think I've got enough money to do this. But we just need something we need something to replace that damn nuclear plant because if that thing explodes uh, our city's done. Our city will pretty much be done. Gotta put me a fancy sign. Oh, gotta speed up time so we can get these turbines running. We'll get these Come on. Come on, win. Come on, people. I'm hiring. Come find your jobs right over here. I'm hiring. Please come. I really don't. Okay. Phew. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Guess what? I am shutting you off. You are unsafe. And we are underpowered. We are going to go ahead and quickly edit this because this is going to be bad. 
is going to be bad. I'm going to put as much wind power as I possibly can in here. Uh, okay, looks like I can't put another one of the big ones. And I'm actually going to demolish this damn thing. And I really don't want that to be a disaster. That is just a horrific thing to be happening in any city. Radiation everywhere. It's just not good. Let's speed this up a little bit. See if we can get. Okay, so we've got some good power coming along, and hopefully I can get one of these things. I'm really running, running, running out of time. We still need. Uh, we've got some extra power in the region. I think for right now, I'm just going to buy from the region. I'm going to buy some power from the region from here. This is good enough. Is, or else, okay, I need to buy more power. Thank you. I'm going to buy from both of you. Thank you very much. Okay, so we're getting a little bit better um, with power. I've got to line more streets and get some more stuff in here. Uh, can I draw through the... Oh, I blocked off my own path. Let's see if I can go in between here. I can't draw through... Oh! I can draw over here. I know. I'm gonna get rid of get rid of this guy real quick. Draw a lane out. Come on, come on. Speed up time so I can get this going. Draw it out here. I wonder if I draw it out to the road. Can I add two here? No, oh, no, I'm not. Well, I can add over here. I can then create a road. No, I'm gonna go ahead and bulldoze this portion. The road right here. Bulldoze. Okay. I'm gonna put down road. Just gonna just parallel it. Hopefully it doesn't snap and cause any issues. There we go. Put it here. Here. One. And hopefully a big one at the end. Awesome. Okay. So I think that's gonna leave me with enough for now. 16 watts, uh, 94.6 watts. So I'm only gathering a little bit from the region, I believe. So I'm spending a freaking lot of money. Okay, we're just going to have to come back to this. We're going to say goodbye. Everybody, thanks for watching. If you like this video, hit like, subscribe. I'll have more coming up. Also, I have uh, another person who will be joining me hopefully soon. And have a great day.